or not gentle, sometimes it's forceful, but good guidance in the right direction. Okay, so speaking of the mentorship type of deal, mm-hmm. um, I actually would go as far to say, because I've had many mentors through my career, um, being a creative, uh, doing photos, doing videos, all that, all the time. Um, I think there's a point, though, especially as you see technology progressing, things like that. Uh, do you think it's possible to really over, really, the master is now the the master, if you will, the, the, the teacher is now the master. Or, you, you know what I'm saying? There's a phrase I'm the forgetting. The Kung Fu Panda finally became the dragon. Yeah, pretty much, 100%. <laughs> so I'm curious what your thought is on that. Um I think it I think it solely depends on the relationship with the mentor. Right? Because it like if you have a business mentor in the business that you're in, yeah, you can definitely eclipse them and honestly, they should encourage that. Right? That should be the goal. Yeah. Right? If you bring somebody under your wing, your goal should be to make them better than you. Right? Yeah, and that's that's always been my goal um as a creative. I'm like, cool. I have this camera, I have this thing, I've done and shot this. I've always wanted to one up the person I've been working with. Um, yeah. Always the case. Um, yeah. Sometimes it's ended poorly, and then other times it's ended <laughs> quite well, and I'm still friends with them. But yeah. um, you some, know, there should be some healthy competition. But that, I mean, that's that's the give back that I was talking about before. It's like this person has benefited from their time. Um, they should be doing this out of, out of like a they believe in you, and b they want to continue that legacy into the world. And if they've turned you into a better version of themselves, like them but better, you know, two point oh. They did. They did it. That should be an accomplishment for both the mentor and the mentee. Absolutely. But when I say the relationship is the important part is because there's a lot of people in my life who give me great guidance, but they have zero direct correlation to what I do. Right. Like they're not building roofs for a living. They're not doing exterior construction. So, I mean, what do you base that off of is maybe your success level, maybe the value of your bank account. I don't know, but that seems pretty fickle. Right. So but I think I think that I think that absolutely you should be on a quest to surpass your mentor and they should want you to get there. Excellent. I like uh, using the phrase quest yeah. at any point in time. That's always a, a me thing. But to get JD back in here, that's yeah. what may happen. Vision quest, baby. <laughs> boo, 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 boo. <laughs> uh, Let's do the Scooby Doo ending. <laughs> no. <laughs> Let's do the Thelma and Louise. Yeah. Wayne's World references here. Uh, We're going back to the early 90s, bud. Going back to movies, I don't know. Um, I've seen Wayne's World. I just don't remember it. Um, That was Lachlan, by the way. Um, He is our uh, resident videographer and then also producer role. So he wanted to jump in here, so we brought him in. He is Um, much more creative than I will ever be. That's, yes, 100%. (laughs) Um, And then 